Yeah, the layman of ethnic Lana uh, is actually very simple. Uh, came to me uh, because we deal strictly with ethnic products, and we are located in Lana country, which is the old name for the province of Northern Thailand. It used to be called Lana. We buy these products uh, here in Chiang Mai and or wherever they come from, and we make bags. So we use outfits that the women in the hill tribes use. I just get very creative and try to use every piece of, of the fabric set that we get. So we work directly with, with many different uh, people, especially the Hmong, the Hmong people here in Thailand. Um, that's, that's who we work with uh, the most. Hi, uh, my name is Vishai. This is my village and we make the handbag. For handbag, this is my business. Uh, maybe 10 years ago, uh, my wife and me, only two people make the bag, the handbag. And my wife helped me the dye color. My son helped me uh, put the fabric on the ground to dry. My family, the big, and my mom, sister, mom. My, my wife have the brother and sister. The brother uh, helped me uh, to cut the fabric. Okay, my mother and sister uh, sold the bag. I take the bag, go to my shop in Chiang Mai. And I think everything good for my family. Fair trade is very important for our business. Um, it's something that is very important to me personally. I was born in Mexico and, and I've grown up um, around you know, villages and small villages. And, been always fascinated about their, their making of their special crafts and, and handmade products and, and now that I have the opportunity to actually help people here in Thailand uh, it's just a great satisfaction personally and I, I think my customers feel the same way. Everything we do we have to make sure that um, whoever is touching the product and from the very beginning that it, it, is, it is part of fair trade and it adheres to the guidelines of fair trade. Yeah, in closure I would like to thank all our customers for their future support in helping us achieve some great goals we have planned at Ethnic Lana here in, in the coming future. Um, all of them helping the, the Hmong Hill tribes here in Thailand. Uh, the first project uh, is going to be to bring internet service to Vichai's village. Um, since he's so far away from the nearest town, uh, all the service providers will not bring the service to the, the lines to their village. So what we have to do is we actually have to purchase the tower, the Wi-Fi tower, and install it in the, in the village. Now we need the tower, Wi-Fi tower, because uh, my village and uh, my people need more work and uh, Wi-Fi and the internet, everything held uh, to my village, everything. Uh, I need more space and uh, more work for my, for my people in my village. Now the second project is to build a, a small factory where we want to hire the local women and teach them the trade and provide some steady uh, employment for them and, and hopefully uh, start teaching them creativity into making different, different types of products which is I think something that, it, that is lacking a little bit there and, and I hope to, to help them in that, that area. So with your orders and the small donations that we're going to ask from you next year, uh, we can make both of these projects and many more a reality. So thank you very much for your help and happy selling. Thank you. Thank you.